Hi, I'm Francesco Lecce Chong, music director of the Eugene Symphony. I'm here with Dave Skidmore of Third Coast Percussion, and we're very excited to be uh, giving a performance of Augusta Reed Thomas's new work, Son Sonorous Earth, uh, here with the Eugene Symphony, uh, co-commissioned by the Eugene Symphony. So, uh, Dave, I just thought, you know, we have 300 kinds of bells here on the stage. <laughs> um, can you just kind of walk us through logistically what we're going to be seeing in this performance? Sure. Yeah. Let's do a little. Uh, let's do a little tour. So. The piece begins uh, with a kind of a really big kind of grand uh, overture and um, that first movement kind of like invites a bunch of us to hear all these incredible sounds from all over the world. So we're performing mainly on these racks and tables um, which include uh, both instruments from all over the world like this Tibetan bell, these Tibetan finger cymbals, these Indian uh, elephant bells, or these instruments which are called kadki, as well as some larger instruments like a taigong up here. And my personal favorite, the Chinese opera gong. Uh, after the first movement, um, we've kind of set the scene, and uh, you'll follow me around here to the front of the stage. Uh, the second movement of the piece features these, which are known by many names. They're called prayer bowls, temple bowls. The Japanese name is Ren. And we have on this table a tuned chromatic set of 26 of these things, the only collection like this in the world. Um, and these instruments are incredible because you can strike them in the way you would normally think of a bell. And they ring forever and ever and ever, but you can also stir with a very particular kind of mallet along the outside of it. And they, as you can hear, they kind of sing and the sound comes from nothing, which as percussionists is something that's unique and rare for us. So after this uh, second movement, which is very sort of introspective and meditative, we go on to this incredible set of instruments. This is a set of 18 Burmese spinning bells, uh, traditionally known as kaizi. And they are traditionally played, as the name implies, spinning. Which as you can hear, creates this cool kind of, um, almost like a vibrato effect. Um, and this third movement is um, sort of dance-like, it's fun, it's groovy. At a certain point, um, two of the players stay at these racks, and then two of us move over here and play the taigongs and the kadki uh, from the reverse side of the instruments. So we're sort of just playing all over the place. And then the last movement of the piece, um, we play every single bell that's on stage. So we uh, start at, at this position here, but then we move all over the stage. Uh, each player moves around throughout the movement and it's really energetic, uh, sort of um, uh, high energy music that, that uh, brings the whole thing together. So I'm just gonna play a little bit of, uh, of this to sort of give you a sense of what all these instruments sound like together. <laughs> Coast premiere of Sonos Earth by Augusta Thomas. <laughs>